Sharon Osbourne is warning fans to be careful what you wish for when it comes to losing weight. In a new interview, the TV star dished on her experience with Ozempic, revealing she isn't happy with the way she looks after dropping 42 pounds. She began taking the medication in December 2022, but has been off it for a while. I'm too gaunt, and I can't put any weight on. I want to because I feel I'm too skinny, the mom of three, 71, explained. I'm under 100 pounds, and I don't want to be. My warning is don't give it to teenagers. It's just too easy, she added. You can lose so much weight, and it's easy to become addicted to that, which is very dangerous, the talk Alan continued. I couldn't stop losing weight, and now I've lost 42 pounds and I can't afford to lose any more. Osborne is more focused on her health than vanity, explaining, I've never really cared what people say about the way I look because I know I've paid a fortune to try and look attractive. I was never a beauty. I was never blessed that way. I was blessed with a pair of balls instead of great tea. She quipped. She doesn't even mind when husband Ozzy Osborne, 74, pokes fun at her appearance. Ozzy's having a go at me because he says I look like Mrs. Reagan, she joked in another interview of how Ozempic changed her look. He calls me Nancy Reagan all the time. Switching up her look is nothing new for the Brit, who has candidly discussed her plastic surgeries over the years. I thought you had, like, a two or three year tune-up, her son, Jack, 38, joked of her operations during a podcast. Every 5,000 miles, mom goes in for a tune-up. You can't suddenly go out, and you've just had a full facelift and not talk about it, she said of why she doesn't deny the procedures she's had done. It's the elephant in the room. Everybody knows you've done something. So we might as well break that embarrassing silence and say, oh, do you like it? And it's ridiculous. It's not a sin to do it. It's not. It's your personal choice, Sharon declared. There should be no stigma to it. If I want to go and have my chin done or whatever it is, it's my choice. And I don't hide the fact. And I'll give people the truth about it. Not all of her operations have gone as planned, admitting one facelift left her looking like a cyclops. It was the worst thing ever. When I was higher than the other, she recalled. I got some scarring down by my nostril to the side of my lip, which I never had before. I can't even begin to tell you what this guy did to me. And then I had to wait for that to heal. And then I went to another surgeon who put it all right for me. Daily Mail spoke to Osborne about her Ozempic weight loss.